to determine the distance across a lake, a surveyor selected two points, P and Q, one on each shore and directly opposite each other. On the shore containing P, another point R was chosen, 50 meters from P. The line segment PR was perpendicular to the line segment PQ. The angle having the sides PR and RQ was measured to be 78.24 degrees. What is the distance across the lake? Okay, to understand the problem, we need to draw and uh, illustrate how this one goes. Okay, so th there is a lake. So this is. Okay. Shore. This is the this is the other shore. Okay, so there are two opposite shores. So this is the lake. Let us color it blue. Okay, and then there are two points. One from each shore. So we have point P and point. Q. Okay, so let us say this is point Q, this is point P, okay, one on each side, and then the two, the two points are directly opposite each other, okay, so directly opposite each other, and then on the shore containing P, so meaning on this side of the lake, Another point R was chosen 50 meters from P. Okay, so if we measure 50 meters from P, say at this point, there is another point R. Okay, so there is another point R when measured from point P. Okay, so the, this distance from point P is 50. Okay, so that is 50 meters. Okay. The line segment PR was perpendicular to the line segment P, uh, PQ. This means that the two lines are perpendicular, meaning they form a 90 degree angle. The angle having the sides PR and RQ, so we need to draw a line RQ, and the angle formed by these two lines, this one this angle okay is 78.24 degrees okay let me write that down here 78.24 degrees what is the distance across the lake now we need this distance we call this d okay for distance d okay so for this case the unknown is d the distance between P and Q. Okay, so to solve this one, we see that the figure is a right triangle with the 90 degree angle at vertex P. Dito sa angle na to P. Okay, and then we are given 50 meters, the angle, and we are asked to solve for D. Okay, so what is the relationship between the given and the unknown? Okay, so we have the angle, this angle, so we may denote that as theta, so theta, okay, but since it's in in, in R, uh -huh, so we can actually say that it's angle R, okay, so angle R is 78.24 degrees and then what is the relationship between this angle and the 50 meters they are adjacent to each other okay so adjacent so the given angle and the uh, given side 50 meters is adjacent okay yung side is adjacent to the angle and the unknown d is opposite the given angle so the two sides involved right here 
are the opposite and the adjacent. So, based from our Sokatoa, we need to use the Toa, the tangent. So, we say tangent of 78.24 degrees is equal to opposite. Opposite is the unknown D divided by the adjacent 50 meters. Okay, so how do we solve this one? We just cross multiply. Ano? So D therefore is equal to 50 meters multiplied by the tangent of 78.24 degrees. So D is equal to 240.70 meters. Okay. Therefore, the distance between points P and Q is 240.70 meters. And this is the distance across the lake. 